In this video, I'm going to show you how to replace your blower motor on this Toyota Corolla. It's located underneath the glove box on the passenger side. Let's get started. To start this job, we have to remove the glove box. All you have to do for this is pull it down on one side. You can pull in on the side here, do the same to the other side, push it, and this will basically unlock it. You're going to have this little piston here that will just slide out with it, set the glove box aside. This will give us access to those two mounting screws that you see right there, either a 10 millimeter or a Phillips head. And we need to take those out because as you can see, the computer is sitting right underneath the glove box. So we need to drop this down, but I don't want to disconnect it and remove it completely. I just want to lower it with the bracket. And these two screws right here are the screws for that bracket. And before I unscrew it, I want to take out these two push clips so I can get this plastic cover out of my way so that when the computer drops down, it can just go as far as the wires will let it. It won't be stopped by these push clips. So just use a plastic trim tool, pop these out of here, fold this out of the way, and use your 10 millimeter socket, remove both of these. There's a little hook right here that you have to push in on. This will make this drop down, hook at the back, and fold this out of the way like that. Next, I want to unplug the electrical connector for the blower motor. Press on the tab that's on the back side here, just pull this wire out and set it aside. I'm going to take an eight millimeter socket and remove the three bolts that bolt this on to the blower housing. I'm going to start with the one that's all the way in the back because that'll be the hardest one to reach and I want to leave the easiest one to reach for last so I can, well, easily remove it while I'm holding the blower motor so it doesn't fall. There's one. Two. Last one. The blower motor will want to drop down so I'm going to hold it with one hand as I unscrew this last one. And down it comes. There's your blower motor. Now take your new blower motor, slide it into position here. And line it up mounting holes just like that. I'm going to try to start this front one because it's the easiest one to reach and if one is in it's going to hold it prevent it from falling out as I start the other two. Next I'll go for this one. Okay, just thread them on a couple threads by hand that'll help it hold them in place. And last one. All right with all of them in let's tighten them up. Now these are only threading into plastic so just be aware that you do not need to make them very tight once they bottom out Basically just go a tiny bit more, just put a little pressure on them and that's it. Because if you strip this, the blower motor will not stay in secured and well, that's an issue. Now we can plug it in. The new blower motor does not require that adapter harness that the original one had. So we can plug this directly into it. Okay, once that's secured in there, we can give it a test. Turn the ignition on, set the blower speed to low, and yep, we have air, medium, medium high, and high. Now we can grab the car's computer, put it back, make sure that this tab over here lines up with that slot. It needs to slide in there first, and then up, and then, and when you slide it up, this hook over here will grab in and basically secure it until you bolt it on. So that we can be done under here, let's put this cover back and put the two push clips back in. And with those secured, thread in these two screws that secure the rest of the bracket for the computer. Make them nice and snug. Now let's reinstall the glove box. These two areas right here are where the hinges need to clip on. These are the hinges right here. So to set it back into place first, make sure that this piston is extended and goes through its cutout here. And then line up the two hinges. Once this lines up, press it into place. There we go. And now all you have to do is slide it up. And there you go, blower motor replaced. When only the best will do, demand TRQ. 
the only company that lets you view before you do. TRQ is committed to offering the highest quality aftermarket auto parts that are engineered for peace of mind. Thanks for using and viewing with TRQ.